Hail and well met everyone, Captain Deadeye is back with you with more World of Warcraft Wrath of the Lich King Classic and our hardcore undead hunter, or not undead hunter, undead warrior. I wish you could play an undead hunter, that would be awesome. Uh, I've, I love undead hunter in uh, retail, that's one of my uh, one of my classes on, uh, one of my alts on retail, so yeah. Anyhow, we are back in our undead warrior, we're going to uh, start working on... Uh, the, the Scarlet Crusade. We're going to head over to Eastern uh, Pierce Fall Glades here and continue working on that. Uh, they're way up here in this very top little corner uh, next to Scarlet Monastery. So we have to make our way over there. On the way, I'm going to stop. There's a lake right here. I think there's a quest in the middle of the lake. Uh, there's a, a lady on an island that gives us a quest. And uh, yeah, we're going to head over in that direction. Hope everyone's doing well. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Thank you for deciding to spend a few moments every day with me. And I hope you guys are enjoying the uh, the new rotation uh, as we, uh, uh, you know, begin our uh, increased hardcore content playthroughs. Uh, you know, because I want to, I definitely want to increase the hardcore content on the channel. It seems to be the what everyone wants to see. It's what's getting watched the most. Um, so yeah, that's uh, one thing I, I'm trying to do. So we played two episodes of retail. We're going to play two episodes of hardcore. Next, we're going to go back to classic and play our, uh, uh, let's see, I think our warlock is up next. I'm not mistaken. I'll have to double check. All right. Yeah. So here's an island full of zombies. Let's see. Okay. So there's, there's the lady right there. Gunther Arcanus. I thought she had a quest for us. Maybe it's a drop that we need to pick up. Why is my... What is happening? Why is this getting reset again? Oh, sorry guys. My key bindings are all gone again. I don't know why this keeps doing this. Yep, it's gone again. It's so weird. Now that one's still there. Control 5 and Shift 1. Those are still there. I don't know why these won't stay. Huh. Yeah, I thought for sure she had a quest, but I guess not. Or maybe, I, there may, I think maybe there's an item that drops we have to bring to her. Because she sends us over here to this other small island right here. And there's like a sacrifice that we have to stop and then uh, kill the zombies around the area. So, pretty sure there's something to do with that. We'll pop the uh, we'll pop troll blood and let's see that's a battle that's a guardian let's pop a, a lion streak this morning And these guys are level either 11 or 12, maybe 13, uh, that we're going to fight these Scarlet Crusade guys. So we'll see how that goes. I have to get warmed up here on the Warrior. I haven't played it for a few days. Once we get down to um, Silver Pine Forest, uh, which is where we're headed next, uh, after we finish all these quests here, I'm not going to finish a Family Crypt Agamemnon Heirlooms. I'll come back and do that at maybe level 15 because that every is hard. 
especially for a warrior. Uh, once we uh, get over into Silver Pine, we may do some zone hopping between there and the Barrens because I want to make sure we're, we stay, you know, around the same level um, as our quest or a little above our, our... I want the quest to be a little below our level, uh, especially as a warrior because they're hard enough as it is, the enemies, and they gang up on you in both areas, so I want to make sure that we're, we're good. Um, there's also random worgen elite that wander around silver pine that are extremely difficult and we don't want to run into one of those guys so we'll probably just zone hop a little bit and make sure that we you know level all the way up through oh, excuse me. 20 to 25 somewhere around there before we head into hillsbrad Hillsbrad, we may actually not even hit that till probably level, maybe level 30. We'll see. Okay, so we're going this way. This is Scarlet Monastery is over there. This is Fole's Rest. Archbishop Fowl or Fole, however you say it. They, uh... He was an Archbishop of the Scarlet Crusade. And was laid to rest there. I think it was Scarlet Crusade. It may have been Lordaeron. Alright. These guys are level 11. Oh, there's two of them. And they run. I still think it's hilarious how we're using a wooden sword. That just... <laughs> that's absolutely hilarious. kill all these guys as we run across here. For XP sake. And there's a mage. Swap potion just to be on the safe side here. Shit. And we got a third one. I got with that one. Not good, guys. Not good, guys. No, run. Run, 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 run. Oh, man. Nope. Keep running. Keep running. Keep running. I did not want three of them. Whew. That was a close one, guys. That potion helped, but not much. Yeesh. That one scared me there. Damn, Pat came along. I got that one. This is the one that scared me because I probably could have taken just the mage, but both of them, not so much. Gasters, man. They suck. Oh, she missed. Haha. <laughs> Whew. That one scared me. Huh. 
Oh, I mean, I missed the revenge. I thought this was supposed to slow them down. Nope, guess not. Well, if I would actually hit them, it might might help kill them. Another another mage, Briar, and a vanguard up there, okay. There's another Nephilite. Alright, let's see if I can pull this Friar down here. I definitely don't want both of them. I don't want that uh, Mage Path to come down either. Oh, come on. Wish I had a uh, counter spell or something to stop them from casting. Come on. Man. Skill with guns not good. It still pulls him. Oh my gosh, just hit him. At her. Oh my gosh, just hit her. Jeez. It's slow. Okay, let's see what's in here. Oh great, we have three of them. That's not going to be fun. Level 12. Oh, they're two level 8s. Okay. Alright, we may be okay. Alright, I gotta, I'm going to sort of power him down. Alright guys, wish me luck. Here we go. Potion just to be on the safe side. All right, guys, we got it. We did it. See, I saw a um, an herb. I think it was over here. I think it was like right here. I definitely got interesting there for a moment with the casters. Phew. I think it's right here. I think it's maybe an earth root over here. Yep, there it is. Sweet. 
Okay. Uh, crap. I should have ran over here and at least got this to pop up on our map. Oh, come on, bat. And he knocked me out of using Victory Rush. Okay. Uh, so, let's finish there. Let's head back to Brill. And then I think we're on to Silver Pine after that. I wish we were higher, a little bit higher level, though. We're only level 12. I wish we were more like 13 or 14. Uh, I guess I could grind it out. Let's run around the north side of the uh, lake here, see if we get any herbs. Do need to make some more potions. I have, I have a few herbs in my inventory. Dog. You know, I probably should um, <clears throat> probably should grind out at least up to level 13. I should have stayed over there with those those scarlet guys and ground that out. Let's go over here and kill some gnolls. Let's see if and at least and for money's sake too, because we only have 16 silver. There's some more herbs too. Let's, let's grab let's grab the silver leaf first. Yeah, I wish we could play an undead hunter. I love, I love Undead and I love Hunter, so I think it would be a fun combination. I, and like I said, I understand why they didn't put it in vanilla, uh, because every other Horde class could be Hunters and they're the same as, they have the same class as, as humans, but, and I, I'm glad they added in Cataclysm, because that was definitely worth the uh, add-on there, right, the extra class. All right, let's kill these guys, and of course they're not going to give us any XP, or very little XP. I should have stayed up there and killed those Scarlet guys. That's what I should have done. Yeah, one copper. We're not going to get any money off these guys either. Yeah, ten copper. Eh, I tell you what. Let's go ahead and make our way down to Silver Pine. I mean, quests there start around level 12. So, I think we, we'll be okay for some of the initial, initial quests. And like I said, we may have to zone hop over to the Varens um, to do some questing there, too. Need to get some more empty vials. We'll, we'll work on our alchemy this morning. And there's plenty of mobs to... Uh, that drop money to... to uh, I think the wargans drop money in silver pine. So there's plenty to grind there. 42 is 42. That's what I have on. I guess I should just hearth back, but oh well. Once we get into Silver Pine, we'll be able to get some Briar Thorn. I'll be able to make lesser healing potions, uh, which are the next step up in our potions.
I need some vials. Let's see. There we go. And you have earth root too. I'm not going to spend my money on that though. You have two lesser healing potions for a silver each or 90 copper each. What now? You have done extremely well, warrior. With ruthless fighters like you conquering in the name of the Forsaken, our race is one step closer to defeating Arthas at once and for all. I have a good feeling about you, comrade. And you give me absolutely nothing to use. A dagger or a hatchet. I'll take the hatchet. Beware. Is about. And we're maxed out on bag space, so let's go ahead and sell. Be quick about Repair. Your let's see. There we go. Do not seek death. And you right, where, are. Uh, where, are we, where are we in herbs? Let's see. Whoops. We're at uh, 76 on herbs. Okay. All right. Alchemy trainer. Minor mana potion. Ah, oh, why did I do that? I didn't need to do that. That was stupid. Why did I do that? That was dumb. I just wasted money on that. Okay. Let's see here. We need to make some. You know, make some more healing potions, I guess. We're gonna need them to make lesser healing potions here. Damn, I think it's nine silver to learn. Eesh. Okay, let's do that. Actually, let's see. Let's do um do two more troll blood. One more lion strength. And then we'll do the rest in healing. I don't have enough money now, of course. Jeez. Crap. Don't have enough money for the lesser. Well, let's go ahead and finish up these miners. I may have to throw them in the bank. Because, well, I'm out of, I don't want to take up two bag slots. So we'll run to the bank and drop them in the bank. At least two stacks of them. I'll carry a few around with me. Once we start getting some Blackthorn, I... Or, uh, Blackthorn? No, Briarthorn. Once we start getting Briarthorn, I will... Continue making potions then. We'll make some lessers. I'll have to come back up here and train. There we go. Alright. We got a 65. So, okay, let's run to the bank really quick. And then over to Silver Pine. Uh, first aid. I don't have enough money to train. I don't think I have enough money to train. Plus, we're into wool, and I'm not getting any wool yet. I won't get wool till around level 20. Speak quickly. 15 to 20. Yeah, see, I don't even have enough to do that. And we have to be 80, so I've, I've got to get more linen. More linen. Okay. We're going to stop by the Undercity, and then on over to Silver Pine, guys.
We'll drop these vials in the bank. Well, I don't know. I may want to carry... I'll carry one stack around with me and we'll drop the rest of them in the bank. Got some silver leaf right here. There's lots of herbs in silver pine as well, so... We won't be hurting for herbs. Even low-level herbs. I thought we were past the Elder Festival. Oh, that's a Keeper of Time. Never mind. I thought that was an Elder. I think we'll make the elevator. Nope. So I'm not sure if you guys were watching uh, Robert Rambles this week on his Undead Priest, like level 23 or something. He fell down this elevator shaft, so <laughs> it always scares me. He basically got caught in the door, he said, and it dropped him as he was running out. So that's no fun. That sucks. I mean, that really sucks because he was doing very well on that guy. That character. All right, let's see. Need to put uh, put a stack of those in there. Put those two stacks. I have ten. That's plenty for now. Um, we have ten additional bandages I need to sell, and then we'll put uh, put all these vials in there. I know where they are. And I want to make sure I got the Flight Master here so we can fly back here from Silver Pine. Yep, looks like we already have it. Okay. Speak quickly. You don't know I need the Flight Pass. No, oh, I have the Bulwark. Okay. What is it? All right, sell these bandages because I don't need them. And okay, and now we're on to Silver Pine, guys. Let's see. Let's run back out. Yeah, the family crypt and the Agaman heirlooms, that that crypt is extremely hard. It, it's it's so hard to pull enemies. They're, they're grouped in twos and threes. They're all like level 12 and 13, and or level maybe 11 and 12, and man, it is, it's so hard for a warrior. I've done it before on uh, other characters, and it's just, I don't even want to try it right now at, uh, at level level 12.
All right, so once we get into Silver Pine, um, there are some quests um, sort of like right here. So the Sepulchre's all the way down here. It's like like maybe like right here. There are some quests right here in a, in a farm that uh, we could pick up on the way to the Sepulchre. The problem is the Sepulchre quest sent us right back to that farm to talk to the same people we got the quest from. So I'm going to pass those up. We're going to go directly to the Sepulchre, pick those quests up there, and then make our way back to the farm because... There's no point in doing them, like basically doing a quest and having to come right back to the same area twice. So I think it's just kind of redundant. I, I think it, what the game wants us, what Blizzard wants us to do is go to the Sepulchre first, then backtrack to those to that farm. And that's exactly what I'm going to do because I, I, I did it on another character recently on the, on a, just a character that I'm playing randomly on the Horde side. And over on Man Creek. And uh, yeah, I figured that out. I was like, yeah, that's not the way to do it. So, yeah, all right, so these guys are level 11. So, yep, like, like I said, level 11, 12, something like that. Just getting into the Silver Pine here. There's plenty of quests though, so, or, well, lots of quests and lots of herbs. And the rain stopped. See, look at that, look at those herbs. Love it. We're going to need a new weapon soon, guys. <coughs> this wooden sword is not going to cut it. And now I have absolutely zero money, so... Yeah, six silver to my name. That's not good. Oh, Murlocs. Yeah, just like the Barrens, the Silver Pine is, is littered with herbs. So, I came over here on my Tauren Shaman to, to do the Water Totem Quest because it's, it's like right here along the coast. And... Well, you guys were with me, and you saw all the herbs we were picking up during that episode. It was, I mean, it was crazy. Or maybe I didn't do it during the episode, but on my way over here um, to do that water totem quest, I mean, it was amazing how many herbs I was picking up. I thought the barons had a lot, but it had nothing on silver pine. Oh. Let's be... Alright. Let's go, Marlocks. I loathe the... And I'm pretty sure you run, too. Oh, man. Yep, that's what I thought. So these guys are going to try to run away. I mean, hey, they drop money, and I'm getting XP out of them, so. Suck. Just hit him. Jeez. And I do need those Discord War cards, so we're gonna hang on to that. I need that for a quest later. Okay, here's the uh, the farm I was talking about. Let's see. Yeah, it's right here. There is this, this farmhouse back here. There's a quest in there.
Yep, see, there it is. But again, he sends us right back here, so we're not going to pick it up right now. I tell you what, let's make a beeline on down to the sepulcher. Rather than stopping and picking up every herb along the way, let's just make a straight line shot to the sepulcher. We'll pick up all the quests there, and then we will set our hearth there and pick up the flight point. Unless the we unless the herbs are right along the side of the road, like these. Look at that. See what I'm talking about? Alright, let's just go on to the sepulcher. I'll come back and get these herbs later. What about the ding? That's nice. Level 13 here. I wish herbs gave you... Um, XP and, and mining gave you XP in classic, but it doesn't. It did not do it back in vanilla either. There's lots of worgen here and lots of worgen quests. I should probably definitely invest in some uh, six slot bags soon too. Because they're five silver each. Uh, I don't have 25 silver to drop into an eight slaughter yet. But that's probably something we definitely need to consider doing. See what I mean? Lots of herbs. Alright. I think this is... This is a sepulcher right here. Ooh, there's some prior thorn. We're definitely going to pick that up. Does it take one prior thorn? Let's see. Lesser healing potion. Oh, I don't have it yet. It's because I didn't have the money to train it. All right, guys, welcome to the Sepulcher. We're going to grab the flight path here really quick. Go. I am forsaken. Supplying the Sepulcher. Executor Hedrick asked me to take stock of their equipment at the Sepulchre. With the Scourge and worse lurking in the woods, he doesn't want the Death Guards to lack gear they may need. They might need. I found what we are I found that we are, in general, well stocked, but we do need more weapons to replace those lost in the field. Here's a requisition order for what is needed for the weapon dealer Gordon Windham in the Undercity. Take this order to our Batmaster, Karos Rezok, and speak to him about a transport to the Undercity. Trust no one. What innkeeper. Is it? I'll make this in my home. Yes, thank you. Trust no one. What is it? What business do you have with me, warrior? Goodbye. Ah, good. The apothecary Johan sends his, uh, to send his... Uh, how good of apothecary Johan to send his research with Johan? 
With so many new developments here in Silver Pine, I nearly forgot about the findings coming out of Lordaeron and Tears Fall Glades, with, which reminds me, I need to get those samples off to the Necropolis soon. But you must excuse my rambling. Extend your stay uh, in, Silver, in Silver Pine, Zangut. We could use able-bodied warrior like you around here. A recipe for death. Arthas's numbers are overwhelming, but with a new plague we call erratic, we could eradicate both the Scourge Army and the human infestation once and for all. My studies have proven that spider blood, combined with a toxin derived from a grizzled bared heart, results in a deadly elixir. Collect samples from the spiders in the skittering dark to the northwest and from the bears wandering through Silver Pine Forest. Deliver all reagents to, uh, to Master Apothecary Farnall at the Royal Apothecary Society in the Undercity. Our time will come. Now, why do I have to take them to the Undercity? Why can't I just drop them off here? Our High Executor Hadric. Hadric, Hadric. Lost Death Stalkers. A couple of weeks ago, two of our Death Stalkers, Rain and Quinn Yorick, were sent on a reconnaissance mission through Silver Pine. We have not heard from them. You may have, they may have become victim to the Scourge. Though, if that is true, I want it confirmed. Find these Death Stalkers. Their first objective was to scout the farms in northern Silver Pine. You should begin your search there. Beware. And there's our quest going back to those farms I was talking about. The Dead Fields. Our initial scouting reports of Silver Pine show that rot hides have a base here at the old farm to the north. At the dead fields of the dead fields, we have sent a small assaults against them, but each time they are reinforced by Banshee's Nightlash, by the Banshee Nightlash, who uses her magic to rout our forces. We want Nightlash destroyed. Go to the fields and assault the Rodhides. If you don't see Nightlash, then kill Rodhides until she appears. Then defeat her. Her essence will turn to dust. Bring me the dust as proof. Our time will come. Okay. Right, let's sell Hello. some. I don't need blacksmithing trainer. I need the armor. Nice. I'll take it. Sell, sell. Like I said, I'm going to hold on to these ward hearts because we will need those later. Victory I should have kept a few vials with me. Instead of dropping them all in the bank. What would you ask? Border crossings. As you may know, the town of Ambermill remains a source of human opposition, mainly through the support that they receive from the Wizards of Dalaran. I do not know what their plan is, but for them to show interest in a backwater village like Ambermill indicates that they have it must have some greater importance. They have been shipping crates by wagons from Hillsbrad. Many of the supplies end up in a small camp north of Pyrewood Village. Retrieve the contents of the crate and return them to me. Farewell. Dalar Dawn Weaver. Prove your worth. Lady Sylvanas has charged Varimathras with conquering the human and dwarven lands to the south. But that fool Arugal, Charlton, Charlton of the Do of Dalaran, and now a cursed beast of Shadowfang Keep, let his reckless magic wreak havoc in the strategic stronghold of Silverpine Forest. I need someone skilled in the ways of combat to help clean up the mess. Prove yourself to me by killing five Moon Rage White Scalps. The wretched beasts can, found can be found just off the road to south, uh, just off the road down the hill below. Trust no one. Okay, so I'm going to hold off on this quest here until we hit level 14. That way we can fly back and turn that in. And then we'll also just collect herbs along the way. So hopefully we'll have enough. Um, we can train up when we go to the Undercity. And we can also uh, do some alchemy while we're there. So now we're on to the White Scalps. They're all around here. It's the Worgen. We need to kill the Worgen. And collect all the herbs. I, I have to get a new weapon. Yeah. Okay. Um, oh, we did not assign a talent either. Let's see. Let's do. Uh, let's do heroic strike. We need grizzled hearts. And these bears. There's one. 
That was an instant respawn. Oh, yep, definitely need Briarthorn, for sure. Got some Swift Thistle in there as, as well. Why do these guys have frost armor? Like, I don't understand that. They're not casters. Interesting music. Just kicked in there. Glutton. We don't need the gluttons yet. Those are the next quests we get. Like I said, there's lots of Worgen and lots of Worgen quests. I think there's like a whole... It starts a whole quest chain with Worgen. Oh, nice. A lesser healing potion. Hell yeah. We'll take that. Thank you. Just hit him. And another waste. Four out of six in the hearts. Five out of six. And six out of six, perfect.
Okay, let's see. We're finished with the white scalps. And we need... What do we need for the other thing? Skittering blood. Oh, that's the spiders. And they are over... They're like up here. We also need to go up here to this farm and talk to the uh, Death Stalkers. We have 10 minutes left. I don't think we have time to do the spiders. So let's go do the... Uh, let's go up to the farm. We'll talk to that guy. And then we may have to hearth back from there. Really? Usually there's herbs along this uh, little ravine here. And they're hard to get to because you have to drop down. And then the ravine's hard to get out of. Alright, so there's a worgen field here. The uh, knolls are just over here to my left. At this farmstead. Farmstead. And then the spider's behind them. Again, we have to watch for the elite Morgan because they they wander, they patrol the whole zone. So we could run a, run up on one and not even realize it. All right, there are the knolls. No, let's see, that's the uh, that's the ghouls. Never mind. They're somewhere like right in here. We'll have to kill them in the next episode. Don't need Maze Royal yet, but I will very, very soon. Oh, come on. Harriet. Nice. Okay, let's go up here and talk to these uh, Death Stalkers.
Like I said, lots of herbs. Good stuff. Grab this one because we're headed back toward the farm next. Space again. Fun. Three slots left. Maybe the Death Stalkers are at the next farm, but there is a Death Stalker here. The ones we actually need to talk to are at the next farm over there. They're over here at this one. But this this quest leads us to that one, I think. Either way, we're going to do it regardless. I am forsaken. Escorting Erlen. The wolves outside won't leave, and the eye... They eye me, they eye me Ill, evilly every time I step foot out that door. They must be incredibly hungry, and I think to think I'm worth eating. I have to report to my teammate, the Death Stalker, Rain York, and to get to Rain, I need to, I need help against those wolves. <clears throat> Please escort me. There are a lot of wolves out there, so we'll have a better chance if your friends, if you have friends who can help. Okay, we're not going to do an escort quest yet because we're definitely not ready for that, and I have to escort him down to the other farm where York is. So. I would probably be okay, but escort quests are hard. There's York. They are very difficult uh, and classic, so I we'll do that next day. time. Maybe when we get level 15, we'll do it. You found us, and not a moment too soon. Goodbye. Wild Hearts. My brother Quinn was, hurt bad, was badly hurt by a ghoul, Ivar the Fowl, and I don't know if he'll heal properly without magical aid. Although I'm not an apothecary, I do know that our apothecaries can make healing potions from the discolored hearts of orcs. Gather such hearts and take them to Apothecary Renfield in the Sepulchre to the south. Then return here with the potion. You can find plenty of wargs between here and Maiden's Orchard in the east. Beware Malden's Orchard. Alright, so we only need one more heart. Let's go ahead and grind that out. I know we're right at an hour, guys, but I'll go ahead and do that. That way, when I hearth back, I can go ahead and finish that up. So let's go kill some more wargs over here at the other farm. And we can sell everything that we don't need over there. At the, uh, Like I said, I knew I needed them. So that's why I've been hanging on to them. I mean, I would probably be okay to do the escort quest, but I don't want to chance it. It's too difficult.
I guess we could have picked that quest up on the way down, that, because we have to go to the sepulcher anyhow. But see, it sent us back here, so either way, it's all good. Oh, come on. I feel like that, that, like, it doesn't even do any damage to the... Okay, there we go. We got it. But sometimes overpower will, uh, will crit, and it does amazing damage. Alright, guys, let's turn this in, and then we're going to call it an episode. My time is short, warrior, for the Dark Lady has charged me with a grave task. Renfrill takes the hearts. It is troubling to hear our Death Stalkers have failed their mission. Let us hope these failures are rare. I'll give you the potion in a moment, but here is the recipe. If those Death Stalkers find themselves in need of future aid, then perhaps you can help them. Trust awesome. No Here's a potion to aid Quinn your recovery. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a very important work to continue. Dark lady, watch over you. Sweet, so we got, a, we got another healing potion. I'll take that. And we got the recipe, wherever that is. Where'd it go? There it is. I'll take that. Thank you. We'll pick up the next Worgen quest here. I am you have served me well, warrior. It is obvious that you will be a worthy aid to me as I prepare to rid Silver Pine of Argyll's curse. How Argyll gained acceptance within Argyll's folly. Arugul's folly. How Arugul gained acceptance within Kirin Tor is beyond me. His spell casting knowledge seemed to be transparent with the blown glass bauble. What's important now is learning exactly what magic Arugul used so that we can turn it against him and secure the Silver Pine Forest for the Dark Lady. Arugul first stayed on the wheat farm just north of the bridge. One of the Dust Stalkers reported seeing some spell books that could not be they but could not secure them. Retrieve them for me. Retrieve them from. Retrieve for me the spell labeled Remedy of Arugul from those books. Beware the living. All right. All right, guys, we're going to pick it up here next time. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. And uh, come back uh, next time for more uh, Undead Warrior action. But until then, guys, I hope everyone has a great day. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. And we'll see you next time.